Hey, what's up, world? My name is Joe, and I'm here with Nicole at hey Scout guys. Logic. And today we want to discuss uh, customization of SP treatments. Yes. So, Nicole, I know you're very passionate about this subject. <laughs> uh, you know, a lot of guys, we, we hear it a lot. Guys yeah. say, hey, I love your Instagram. Um, I've been watching you for six months, I've been watching you for a, a year. year. Uh, but I did see one picture in particular, yeah. and uh, I was just really turned off, and I kind of just went away for a couple of months because uh, the whole that, that just scared the whole concept. Yes. So, and I, I guess the thing is, everybody thinks that you see one picture and it's like, okay, that's the ex exception. That's the overall, um, the gist of SMP, but it's not. I mean, especially with us, again, our, we're speaking from our perspective. It is so customized with every single person. I mean, we have completely sure. different requests. We'll have a guy that comes in that wants something completely different than the next guy. And then again, you got to take age into consideration. You got to take lifestyle. You got to take where they live sometimes. Sure, sure. I mean, there's so many different things yeah. that you have to take an account for. When it comes to SMP, especially with us, it's very customized. <coughs> it's like if you're coming in and you're saying, look, I want something so subtle, barely, and we get that. We get the guys that it's like, barely want anything done. They just sure. kind of want to give a little bit of illusion, but not too much. Sure. They want when they go on their sun, it still looks a little bit bare. Mm -hmm. So again, that's what we're going to create for that guy. The whole point of it is that it's customized. And then we right. have your other guy that's like, I want it as dark as possible. And we're like, whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> I think with those ones, yeah. we're a little like, okay, let's kind of calm down a little bit. Let's, yeah. uh, let's uh, think about this. Because again, it's part of our job is giving you 100% what you want, but it's also... Um, giving the feedback of, hey, how is this going to look in 10 years? How is this going to look in mm -hmm. five years? That's how is right. this going to look as you age? Like, right. when you have grandkids, are you going to be happy with your hairline? I mean, those are just things that I think that we bring to the table with each and every client. Sure, sure. It's definitely a necessary conversation. Yes. Um, I don't think we see enough of it happening in the industry. Nope. I think we, we see very little of it. Nope. Uh, you know, with that, we see pictures on the internet. Um, and without, you know, disrespecting anybody, we see people kind of... Um, as I like to put it, advertising their ignorance, meaning they gave maybe a, a, a okay result today, uh, but they're kind of making the, they're kind of uh, ruining the guy a yeah. year or two down the road. I can yeah. see it. The ink that's sitting there today is just going to keep going into the skin, into the skin. Um, so, so yeah, again, it's customizable, but you got to keep in mind, you never compromise the, the, the natural appearance that, you know, most people are looking to achieve. Specifically with your head. I think that's a really good reference. I mean, you had that really almost kind of darker look going on. I had, had it, yeah. It lasered removed. Yeah. And the other day we were just talking, we were talking with the client as well. And the client's mm -hmm. like, wow, your head is so natural. It's like so subtle. It's like so yeah. barely there. Yeah. And honestly, what is it? It's that it's soft. It's that it's um, lighter applications. Right. I mean, there's less ink in there. Because like you said, we were talking earlier and mm -hmm. you said all you can do is really you don't want to just keep adding ink, adding ink. Right, right, yeah. Actually, uh, when talking about customization, um, you know, it's not too common, but a lot of guys, you know, this is always an interesting conversation. Do I want to do anything in yes. these areas here? And you do a quick search on the internet, you'll see a lot of, uh, that's where a lot of people lose it. Yeah. A lot of people are agreed, turned off agreed, by agreed. S&P. Yes. A lot of artists who are, are mediocre, mm -hmm. that's where I say, oh, no, what are they doing on the sides there? You know, there's two yeah. elements to S&P. One element is tattooing, which is way different than body art tattooing. Um, and then the other element is just drawing the hairlines, which is why so many barbers come into this industry and excel right, mm -hmm. from, right from the gate. Um, but in that area there, like you said about packing the ink, you can only put too much ink before it's yes. game over. This is such a sensitive area because the skin is so thin. Uh, when it comes to customization, this is where, um, this is where I'm very proud of my 10 years experience. Uh, I've made the mistakes. I've seen the mistakes. I've taught people the mistakes. I know what ones to make, uh, what ones not to make and how to avoid them. Um, this is this is this is night and day difference between yeah. uh, experience and not experience. So those areas, if you're looking into this, or if you're just kind of questioning what I'm saying, again, do a quick internet search. I think you'll see pretty fast. A lot of people are making the mistakes in those areas there. Um, and again, lack of experience is really what it is. And I think yeah. also it's. Uh, I don't feel that in the industry a lot of people are really thinking how is it going to look long term. I think that's something that is really missing. Yeah, is it's, it's, it's really just it's in the it's moment. True. Let's cover up what's going on right now. Right. And if you if we have to see you in another five years, we'll we'll see you then. You don't have to pay the piper the first year when it comes to customization. People don't know what was just done to them. They yes. don't fully grasp it. They yes. haven't lived it yet, right? Yes. We've seen people live yes. it. We've seen them come back. 
And um, yeah, again, it all comes down to the customization, but it really, it boils down to the experience, the knowledge base, doesn't it? I think it's also really the consultation that we have with each person. I mean, we're really digging into right. them and what it's they case by want case. long it's term, custom. not it's just custom. right now. That's right. That's right. There's, um, you know, we're, we're happy to take suggestions, uh, you know, people come in with pictures of what kind of hairline flow they think they like or old pictures of themselves. But as we always say, no, no two hairlines are like, it's like a snowflake or yeah. a fingerprint. Everyone's going to be a little bit different. Yes. So. Um, so like you said, so many variables, where you live, what you do for a living, we're looking to achieve your future plans, all your that kind of stuff. Your skin type, how you take care Talk of your, your skin, skin, all actually. of that, all your immune system, all yeah. of it, all of it. Mm -hmm. Cool. So there you have it. So very customized, very, very customized. Um, we really want to, want to, uh, we really want people to know that just because you see one picture, you don't put that in your mind. It's not going to translate to you. That's it. That's exactly how the SMP, that's, that's it. how it would look on me. It's going to be this cookie cutter thing. That's not what it is at all. Right. Um, I would really suggest, whether it's us, whether it's somebody else, is really going in there. Not even going in there. You can make a phone call. You can talk to people and just get suggestions and really relay what you're looking for. And sure. find somebody that's going to respect what you're looking for and be able to achieve that. Not just right now, but again, long term. Sure, sure. Uh, one last piece of advice. Uh, again, with the premise highlighting, it's customized. Yes. It's customizable. Uh, if you're considering getting this done and looking at somebody, consider a, a, a test spot. We do a free test spot. Um, maybe the size of like a pinky nail is all you have, you know, right in the right. I mean, a really conspicuous area where someone can't see it. Yes. Essentially, is what I'm yes. trying to say. I think a lot of people worry about test spot. They're like, "What do you mean? I'm going to get a test spot, and then I'm just going to like, what if I don't like it? And it's just right sure, here." Sure, sure. But let's say you're, you're losing your hair, that typical horseshoe pattern. We put it right where the hair meets the hair loss, so it'd be hidden in there, and um, you know, it'd be even more soft, even lighter yes. than what we do if we were doing the treatment, right? So we're talking like. Uh, uh, it'll only be yeah. there for a couple of days yes. if, if an artist knows how to really do exactly. it, right? I'd be so yeah. shallow that it's going to essentially fade away in a few days' time. But you'll get a chance to see what the ink likes look on your looks like on your head, yeah. how it matches your hair color, all that kind of stuff, whatever you look for. What it for. feels like, because that's another concern, obviously. Sure, sure, yeah. sure. All of the above. So, um, yeah, I mean, again, there's no hiding. That, that, that's why I love, you know, we're, we're, we're happy to be transparent, as transparent as possible trying to put the microscope on just the hair loss industry in general, but yeah. especially what we know is the S&P game. Um, there's nothing to hide. It's really magical all by itself if you really just do your information and find the right people. So We always have people come in when we're working on somebody else, and we love for people to come in and really just see our results on somebody on the third Seeing session. Seeing somebody in person. Yeah, I mean, yeah, that makes the world of difference. It does. Compared to a picture, does. compared so to does. hearing our word, yeah. look at our work. Talk to our client firsthand. I think that's huge. Anywhere that you're thinking about going, that's a big deal.